and I'll bend it down so you can see the leaves better. The leaves are very long and pinnately compound. I'll take one off. Um, with many leaflets along the uh, rachis of the, of the leaf. It has smooth edges to the leaf, except at the base of each leaflet, there's one little tooth. And that distinguishes this from black walnut or sumac, both of which have sim similar leaves, but those have teeth all along the edge of the leaf. Another way to tell tree of heaven is to take a piece, crush it, and smell it. And it smells like rancid peanut butter. It's very distinct. Once you've smelled it, you'll remember it. Tree of Heaven is one of the fastest growing trees that we've got in the country. It grows three to four feet per year. And that means when it seeds into an area like this, this is just a three-year-old tree. And very quickly, it outstrips the growth of the oak trees, the hickory trees, the, all the other trees that are out here. And you turn what was a, a um, grove of native hardwoods into a grove of Tree of Heaven. Um, it also has a cardiotoxin in the sap of this tree, so avoid cutting it and getting the sap on yourself. It can cause um, symptoms similar to a heart attack. The best way to control this is usually to use a basal bark method. You apply herbicide to the outside of the tree to kill it. Tree of Heaven.